the Dandy Dinmont Terrier. This little guy is dandy by name, but not by nature. He's quite the tough guy and always up for hunting. He does have an affectionate side though, and around the house he's respectful without being too clingy. He's a very loyal little man, good with children and suitable for older people too. He's a very intelligent dog with an independent streak, but this can make him a little unsociable with other dogs and a bit reserved with strangers. Hunting is in his blood, so give him a chance to have a go in a safe place and he'll be happy. Daily walks are important for him, otherwise he gets frustrated and he'll start digging. In fact, he may dig anyway. They do. His hair is fairly hard, but not wiry. He does need brushing and combing at least twice a week. He will also need regular scissoring and shaping. A clip four times a year is just about right. The coat will lose its texture and color until it has a chance to grow back again. Interesting facts. This breed's quirky names come from a character created by Sir Walter Scott in his novel Guy Mannering. Scott owned several pepper and mustard terriers, that's how they were previously known, and gave his famous farmer character Dandy Dinmont several of these dogs. They are also very rare, with programs in the UK set up to try and save the breed. The Dandy Dinmont Terrier, a perfectly loyal companion for all ages. <laughs>